Hi, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to create some simple charts in Excel. Okay, so to start off with, I've got a data set here with some uh, a load of data from the FIFA 20 game. And I've got a few questions on the right hand side, which I'm going to answer. And then I'm going to produce some charts, which are going to give a visual representation of my data. So the first one here asks me to work out how many players are right footed and left footed and then to insert a pie chart to show my answers so what i'm going to do is i'm going to click where it says right and i'm going to uh, click on auto sum and then more functions and select count if okay now what i'm going to do now is select the range and my range i've put here on the spreadsheet for you uh the start row and the end row so you don't have to scroll all the way down and i'm going to use column g so it's g2 colon g19627 and i know that i've got it right because it brings up on the right hand side here it brings up the left, right, etc., etc., and then my criteria here. I'm going to type in right, and because it's a word, I make sure that I put speech marks either side of it. And then again, I know that this is correct already because it's given me the answer underneath just here. So I click OK, and it's given me the answer. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to repeat that. And as if by magic, there we go, it now says it on the left. So the next thing that I want to do is I want to put a pie chart in, which will enable me to visually conceptualize and demonstrate this data to make it easier to read and more presentable. So what I'm gonna do is nice and easy, I'm gonna select where it says right and the numbers and then go down again and select my labels and my data here like that at the top i click insert and then i've got a range of charts here i'm just going to click on a pie chart like so it'll give me my options let's say i've picked that one there and it's created a basic pie chart for me which i can then click and start to edit so i'll say right versus left foot Okay, and then I can just make that smaller and put it into the area that I've designated for it. Okay, so once we've put a bar chart in, I'm going to show you how to put another chart in now. Um, so coming on to question two, how many players from the following countries? Uh, same principle again. All I'm going to do is once I've put my calculations in, I select my data, I go to insert at the top, and then I have a range of charts here. I'm just going to select a, a bar chart like this. And then, so a column chart, I should have said. And then I simply click on column chart, and hey presto, there we go again. There is my chart that I can just move in. And then add a title to and say give a proper name number of players from each country there we go 